So hello dreamers and welcome back to Dream Queen by Perla. So Libra, this is your weekly reading. And again, guys, these readings are general. So only take whatever applies. We have missing something and wanting more of something or someone. I feel that there, there was something that you guys may have been passionate about, whether it was a project or an idea or something like that. And then something happened and you, you just kind of like gave up on it, right? And, and all of a sudden, it's almost like this rekindling of of that energy of like this you're 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 refining or reconnecting with some type of passion of yours that may have seemed to be lost and when you when you reconnect with this passion with this um this desire whatever it is for you guys i feel that things just start to kind of click and the more you emerge in it the more that you work in it the more that um the, the more of it that you want um so again this can be anything from like you know you started working out again um you started reading more you started taking walks more you whatever it was is there something that you're passionate about that maybe you kind of shy away or you had to stop because of you know the day-to-day -day life or whatever and now it's like you you found some time to go ahead and start this up again and now it's like you guys are it's, it's almost like you guys are obsessed with continuing on um or with with the the hobby or yeah it's like it's almost like a hobby or a project that you guys are oh excuse me that you guys um kind of do not want to take a break from let's just put it that way um there is someone's energy here where um it, there, there is like almost like a rekindling of a certain connection. I don't feel that this is a connection that has been broken or a, a connection that has been separated, but there's almost more of like passion had been lost or was kind of dormant between you and this person. This can be your husband, your partner, whoever it is, but it's like, it's almost like there's been this rekindling of the passion. Let's put it this way, like in the bedroom where you just want more, they want more and there is definitely a lot of sexual energy here between the two of you that I am picking up. And there is, for some of you, there is some type of breakthrough or something that you have learned or um, that you're seeing when it comes to manifestation that you're really loving, you're really excited about it. And maybe that is what is pushing you forward to not wanting to stop and wanting to continue on. Um, it, it's almost like, you know, whatever you felt was lost was really not lost. It was just was kind of like put in the back burner it was kind of like dormant within yourself or within a certain situation and the minute that you allowed it to be freed let's put it this way from within yourself or within this connection it's like you see how passionate you truly are about someone or something and now there is no pulling away um or no stopping it um for whatever the reason the number eight keeps on popping up whatever that number eight is maybe significant to you specifically but it's like just remember to say number eight so i'm saying number eight um back to what i was talking about where again th there was something that was missing um there was some type of desire some type of passion that you felt um for a very long time that was missing for your life from your life and it's like you have found it and it's almost like you're becoming a little obsessive with it because you don't want to go back to living without this in your life or without you don't want to go back to living without this feeling the feeling that it brings the satisfaction that satisfaction the happiness the joy that it brings to your life you don't want to live without that so we have the ace of cups here with the nine of cups in the reverse and then the king of swords so again there's something that is filling up your heart that is filling you up with joy and you don't want you don't want it to end you don't want to ever go back into spaces or energies where you feel anxious or you feel moody or you feel depressed so you're trying to hold on to something very tightly um just be careful with that energy again because it, there is a sense here of maybe there are some childhood um energies of trauma or things that may have occurred in the past that you have not dealt with or that you have not healed that every time something good happens you want to hold on to it but it's almost like you become 
suffocating to the situation or you become overly obsessive with it that then you end up losing it or the passion the the drive of it let's put it this way runs out as quickly as it came again here we have the three of swords with the four of cups the six of cups in the reverse there is something that you're there is some type of healing that i feel that you guys are running away from there's something that you don't want to face that kind of again this is a repetitive patterns for you guys that i'm picking up here where you emerge yourself into something to avoid the healing process of something and again it's like whatever this is for you whatever this painful situation is for you is that you get to a certain point right in the healing process and then you feel like you're not going to be able to get to the other side or you feel like you're not going to be able to overcome this so it's so much easier to just run away and hide and you're being told to go ahead and face this and allow yourself to overcome this once and for all um if this is um in regards to love we have here the strength with the queen of wands and the king of wands um so we do have a perfect match um again i i am picking up this very like um sexual type of energy or this energy of like just wanting to spend a lot of time with your significant other um i feel that there may have been things that may have occurred in the recent past that may have tested this connection um again this is for those people that are like married or living with somebody this is not a rekindling of a connection that has broken up this is not about people that have split up and then coming back these are people that actually stayed together and worked through some through issues or whatever but there was kind of like a drought when it came to the bedroom or a drought when it came to certain passions that, that the two of you share that and that is what is being rekindled here the sexual energy or the passion in the bedroom or the passion that, that the two of you share for you know certain things or just for enjoying life or something like that hope that makes sense libra that is all that i'm picking up for you for this week as always guys thank you for all the love and support thank you for liking sharing and subscribing to the channel as well as donating if you would like a private reading the link to my website is down below in the description along with the links to the gift cards that are now available um you can also follow me on facebook instagram and patreon sending every single one of you love strength and blessing guys take care love you all Mwah. bye bye